Question 1. Look at the topographic map below. Which label point on this map has the highest elevation? A, B, C, or D? Question 2. The illustration below represents a satellite image of Earth. Which feature is shown in the middle of the picture? A, a desert, B, a mountain, C, rivers, or D, glaciers? Question 3. Look at the topographic map to the right. Assume the distance of each route is the same. Which route would be the easiest for a hiker to climb to the top? A, B, C, or D? Question 4. The satellite image below shows a ship channel between South Padre Island and Boca Chica Beach in South Texas. Sand is sometimes removed from the ship channel through a process called dredging to make it easier for ships to travel through. Recently, sand from the bottom of the channel was moved to area beaches. Without this transfer of sand, what would most likely occur in this area in the future? A. The ship channel would become deeper and the island would move west toward the mainland. B. The ship channel would become shallower and the beach would become narrow, narrower. C. The ship channel would narrow and the island would become completely covered with water. Or D. The ship channel would become wider and the island would sink into, sink into the gulf. The points labeled W and Y on the topographic map below show the campsites of two families. Each family hiked the elevation on the map marked X. The arrow shows the paths taken by both families. What was the change in elevation to the nearest 10 meters for the family that took the steepest path to point X? Record your answer and fill in the bubbles on your answered document. Be sure to use the correct place value. Question 6. The satellite photograph below shows a large meteorite crater that is 1,200 meters in diameter and 170 meters deep. This crater is located in a flat, arid part of northeastern Arizona. How will this crater most likely change over time? A. It will get deeper as it fills with water. B. It will rise up like a volcanic crater. C. It will become less steep as the rim erodes. Or D. It will widen as it fills with lava. Question 7. A section of a topographic map is shown below. What is the difference in elevation in meters between point X and point Y on the map? Record your answer and fill in the bubbles on your answer document. Be sure to use the correct place value. Question 8. Look at the topographic map below. Which cross section best represents the profile along straight line AB? Question 9. Look at the topographic map below. Which letter represents the peak of the mountain? A, B, C, or D? Question 10. A map with contour lines is shown below. Which of the following is the best estimate of the difference in elevation between Black Bear Camp and Eagle Peak? A, 400 meters, B, 900 meters, C, 1200 meters, or D, 1500 meters?